So here is the sheet set that I bought on Amazon. And it didn't take me too long to look for it. I knew what I kind of wanted. Something fall colors, so either orange or brown. Um, I don't know if you'd call this orange. What color is this? Um, <laughs> it's kind of a rust, rusty color. I can't remember the name of it. But anyway, so it's a seven piece set. Here are the two shams that it comes with. And I have a king size bed. So one sham is plain orange, another one is plain orange. And there's two shams that have this um, kind of tan leaves on it, which I think is really nice. So I wanted something that wasn't too busy, but something that I wouldn't get tired of as well. And here's the fitted sheet. So I'm gonna take, open this up. So when you get your sheets, you guys, what do you wash them with? Just detergent, do you put downy gain to make them smell good? Um, I have some um, um, washer whiffs, it's called Pink Cotton, it's Scentsy, and they look like this. They look, uh, can you see that? And so um, I've, I'm going to add a couple of cups to the washing machine so that they can so that my new sheets can smell good. I need to be plate. I'm going to be placing another um, Scentsy order soon, and so I'm going to be ordering more of those. If you've never used them before, I like them, and they last a long time. I've had that container. It's a 48-ounce container. I don't use it in every load, um, but I've had that container for a few months now. And then this is the flat sheet, and if it was up to Raleigh, we would never even use a flat sheet. We would just have the fitted sheet and that would be it. But um, no, I need to have the flat sheet on top too. And then you can see that this is um, really sealed well and this is the comforter. I'm not gonna wash this, um, but I am just going to take it out of this container and I'll do that in just a minute. So I'm gonna add some soap to the washing machine and get that going. What kind of soap do you guys use? I use, here's my closet in my <laughs> laundry room, in case you're wondering, okay. So right now I have this open, which is Purex 4-in-1, brightening and whitening, powerful, clean, tough on stains and boost to freshness. And they look like this. And I usually just use one, sometimes I use two, depending. Depending on what's on sale, this was on sale at the um, at Vons when I was there last time, so I went ahead and bought that. And then um, I have pine salt in my cupboard because I often add pine salt to my wash. And then of course there's bleach. Here's downy sheets. I don't always use downy. Um, there's a couple of brands that I like to use, but downy is probably my favorite. And okay, so I put that in there and I'm just going to start the washer and then I'll go open up the comforter so you can see what that looks like. We are in my bedroom now, and this is the comforter that I have on my bed right now. And as you can see, my pillows are all kinds of mix match crazy because Raleigh put them on our bed last time when he changed the sheets, and you know, being matchy, matchy is not important to him. So <laughs> these are his two pillows, my two pillows, and all that craziness so all right here is the comforter and let me go ahead and open it up so you can see what it looks like i just threw it over the other um comforter that was on there oh my gosh i'm gonna love that that looks really nice i'm sure once i get all the shams and the pillows on and everything it's going to look even better i'm going to need to clean off our nightstands um i have a whole bunch of stuff on mine right now and um Raleigh's always stays pretty clean over there and then get some either new pictures or get some um, some fall something something to add over there to the sides of that and everything will just be ready for fall and ready to go and I keep saying that I'm going to get a rug to put over here um, and I don't know if I will or not um, so we'll see but that's pretty Oh my goodness, I'm really happy about that. I'll be back when the sheets and shams are out of the dryer. All right, they're out of the dryer. So now I can put them on. Oh my goodness, there are my two pillows. 
already with the sham and the pillowcase on. So the sham has the um, flower on it or the leaves and then the pillowcase is just the regular solid just like that which is great which I like. Oh my gosh, this is a really pretty color and it is so soft. Um, this video is not sponsored at all, but boy, if this company wants to sponsor me, I'll be happy to try some more of your products. And then after washing the sheets and the pillowcases, everything is just really soft. Oh my gosh. And okay, I'm gonna put Raleigh's pillows pillowcases and pillowcase and sham on his pillows right here. So I was thinking about this while I was putting the um, pillows on. Okay, so when you're facing the bed like this, what side of the bed do you sleep on? I always sleep on the right hand side and Raleigh sleeps on the left and doesn't matter where we go, like when we went to Michigan this summer, we we're at his brother's house and stayed in his bed or we're in a hotel room or wherever we are. I always sleep on the, the right and Raleigh always sleeps on the left. Isn't that funny how we do that? We're such creatures of habit, I think. At least we are. So I'm gonna finish putting these on and there we have it, just like that. Today, I think I did say that today was Thursday and I know I said that this comforter set was new but I don't think I ever said, welcome to the open collab, hashtag new to me, hosted by our sweet friend Kimmy at Kimmy's Kitchens and more. Oh my gosh, guys. I think I went the whole video without saying that. But every Thursday, Kimmy Kimmy invites us to share something that is new to us and there are a lot of people sharing lots of new and fun things that they pick up or that they come in contact with throughout the day and throughout the week. And if you watched my recent Target haul video where I was sharing that I got some earbuds, they were Skull Candy earbuds, well, you know what? I ended up having to take them back. I took them back today because I just could not get them to pair with my, my phone. So. I just took them back and I tried and tried and it should have been a lot easier than it was and it wasn't so and I didn't have time to get another pair to think about it so I just had to come home and start getting some stuff done. Get some some fall something something for the nightstands over there so that it starts to look a little bit fall in here until it's time to put our Christmas comforter on so all right guys thanks for stopping by check out the hashtag new to me and I will talk to you again soon bye bye